So recently, NASCAR driver Bubba Wallace, uh, who championed the removal of the Confederate flag from NASCAR events, has been under fire on the right wing. So it's a bit of a complicated story. So let me just get through and just go through and do a little bit of a recap of everything that's happened because it's been a lot of misinformation, a lot of drama, uh, especially from the right wing. But the story is basically that uh, Bubba Wallace uh, in the garage at Talladega has a pole that looks like a noose, a, a garage door pole, right? So now Wallace had recently moved into this Talladega garage and had been told because Bubba didn't, you know, Bubba Wallace didn't actually discover it himself. Uh, but the uh, president of NASCAR had said, hey, look, um, <laughs> you got a noose here. I think somebody is trying to do a hate crime on you, right? And so, again, this was understandably right after the Confederate flag was removed from and basically banned from NASCAR. And so it's not a stretch to think that, okay, there's somebody who's mad because there are people that really, really love that flag uh, that are racist with Bubba Wallace being the face of that and saying that, yes, we should get rid of that. Also, Black Lives Matter. It's not a stretch to think that somebody would actually put that up in his garage. So now we got some details, however, uh, that according to an investigation by the FBI, it was not the case that Bubba Wallace was never a target of a hate crime. Uh, and that that noose, that uh, thing that looked like a noose, right, um, had been there since October of 2019, long before Wallace had actually moved into that garage. So therefore, he's not it, it, it's not considered to be a hate crime against Bubba Wallace. So now Bubba Wallace says, look, I didn't know. Right. I didn't find this out. I wasn't the one who reported it. Somebody told me and I was like, oh, wow. You know, am I a victim of a hate crime? It seems like it. That sucks, right? So he's kind of the victim there, right? So now a lot of people, once the FBI investigation comes out, starts accusing him of being like Jesse Smollett. Uh, Jesse Smollett. So now Smollett had allegedly set up a hate crime against himself. Allegedly, right? That's the allegations. Uh, and so now they're saying, I can't believe Bubba Wallace would hang up a noose in his own garage. Why would he do such things? Well, he didn't. <laughs> Uh, and so now the update to this uh, is, well, okay, before I get to that, on Tuesday, Wallace said he had never seen a garage pole tied in that manner. And he said, look, it may not be a hate crime against me, but that looks a hell of a lot like a noose. All right. And so maybe that's like the issue is why has there been a thing that looks like a noose in this garage for so long, since 2019? That seems kind of weird. Uh, and so now the update, of course, uh, is that we now have an image of what this is. Uh, and so this was released by the FBI. I'm sorry, um, NASCAR. It's released by NASCAR after the FBI investigation. And so I want to show you and, and, and see if this, what you think, right? But here it is. I mean, that's that's what it looks like. Now, it's, again, supposed to be a garage door pull, right? But it looks a hell of a lot like a noose. I mean, it's tied like a noose. It looks like a noose. It's a noose. That's a noose. <laughs> so I'm just saying, right? But no, the right wing, uh, and there's the controversy here. You have the right wing, uh, you have bad actors, especially saying, oh, you're just inventing racism. How dare you pull a Jesse Smollett? Well, racism doesn't exist, but the Democrats keep, keep bringing this back up and they're race hustling. Well, that's hilarious because racism does exist. I mean, we have tons and tons of instances of it. We don't have to invent things. You can just go to a Trump rally and you find tons of racism there. Right? And so, look, in this case, NASCAR didn't quite get it right, even though they're like, look, uh, that is a noose. We found that. It definitely looks like a noose. Uh, and so somebody put it up, even if – even if uh, Bubba Wallace himself wasn't the target of this, somebody might have been. Or even if that, it's still, why is there a noose hanging up in this garage? Hey, that's a good question, right? Why is there? Why is there something that looks like a noose 
Uh, and so, like, yeah, I'm going to ask, like, how come everybody was okay with this before then? People had to have known. Now, Wallace didn't know, right? Again, he just moved into that. Uh, and so he didn't know that it was there, but it was there for quite some time. And it's the only place, the only place, the only garage that has a pole that looks like that, by the way. Because, look, NASCAR checked all 29 tracks where they race and over 100, uh, I'm sorry, over 1,600 garage stalls. You know what they found? They found 11 pull-down ropes tied in a knot and just one tied as a noose which happens to be in Wallace's garage. Coincidence, right? Big coincidence. <laughs> really odd. And again, after Wallace says something, well, now he's being attacked in ironically racist ways. I mean, it really is a, a, a very odd story, right? And so understandably, NASCAR is very concerned uh, about Wallace's safety especially now that he's getting attacked in racist ways, which is funny because if you're going to try to prove that you're not racist and that racism doesn't exist, maybe you should not be attacking people in racist ways. I mean, it's kind of counterintuitive, like way to prove to people that you're not racist, like nailed it. 